eight, seven, six, five. Categorically speaking, a weekly battle of knowledge and quick recall by students from high schools in the six county Bay Area on subjects ranging from fairy tales to Shakespeare, peoples of ancient times to the newsmakers of today, vocabulary, literature, U.S. and world geography, and the world of sports. Each week, two high schools meet with a winning school moving on to the next round. Now, the man who asked the questions, Bob Higby. Good afternoon. Today is categorically speaking, fits a team from the Academy of the Holy Names against one from Sarasota High School. I'll ask the team members to introduce themselves, giving their name, age, and year in school. First, our team from the Academy of the Holy Names. Nancy Lemrose, 16, senior. Wendy Wood, 16, junior. Laura Green, 16, junior. Sally Sheehan, 14, freshman. Robbie Parsons, 15, sophomore. And the coach of the Holy Names team, Sister Rose Christina. Now their opponents from Sarasota High School. John Stokes, 17, senior. Tim Corrigan, 17, senior. Michael Ronick, 17, senior. Jeff Mamaro, 18, senior. James Tutsock, 17, senior. And the coach of the Sarasota High team, Mrs. Beth Blankel. Now those are the players. Very briefly, the way we play our game, questions are divided into three sections. In part one, I'll direct a question to a specific team. Any member of that team may give me the answer, but he or she must work entirely on his own. No talking now, no team effort at all is permitted in part one. The team addressed will have seven seconds, the time starting at the end of the question, in which to give me an answer. If there's no answer or it's incorrect, the other team will have a chance to pick up the points. And in part one, all correct answers are worth five points. All right, the first question goes to Holy Names, the category World Geography. A famous U.S. naval base here derived its name from the oyster beds nearby. Name this base. That is Wendy. Pearl Harbor. Pearl Harbor, Hawaii. Right, five points for Holy Names. Sarasota, what is it's the category? This is a liquid which we normally put on salads. It's made by converting alcohol to acetic acid. Can you identify the liquid? That is James. Vinegar. Vinegar, right, five points, Sarasota. Holy Names, the Bible. Who was it that had visions of the stars, moon, and sheaves of wheat bowing to him? That is Wendy. Joseph. Joseph, right, in his green. That's five points, Holy Names. Sarasota music. Name the wind instrument that is made up of 16 feet of coiled brass. That is Mike. French horn. French horn, right, five points, Sarasota. Holy Names Literature. Scott's hero, Quentin Durward, was from what country? That is Moira. England? No. Uh, Sarasota? Uh, Tim. Scotland. Scotland, right, it was Scotland. I had to have the exact answer. Five points for Sarasota. Sarasota fish, what is the name of the organ with which a fish obtains oxygen from the water? That is John. Gills. The gills, right, five points, Sarasota. Holy names, famous names, the category here. Who was it that orbited the Earth in the capsule Friendship 7? That is Moira. Alan Shepard? No. Uh, Sarasota. John? John Glenn. John Glenn, right, five points for Sarasota. Sarasota Foods category, name the sweetening syrup that is obtained from pomegranate juice. That is Tim. Grenadine syrup. Grenadine, right, five points for Sarasota. Holy Names Movies category, name the Oscar-winning film that ended with the attack on Pearl Harbor. Sarasota, can you tell me? That's Jeff. Tor, tor, tor. No, from here to eternity, it ended with the attack. No point on that one. Sarasota, the Bible. In what town was Mary living when she was visited by the angel? That is Tim. Bethlehem? No. Holy Names, Nancy? Nazareth. In Nazareth, right. Five points for Holy Names. Holy Names science category. What is the proper word for the lid of the voice box? That is Robbie. Larynx? No. Sarasota? Jeff? 
The epiglottis? The epiglottis, right. That's the limb. Five points for Sarasota. <clears throat> Excuse me. Sarasota, U.S. geography. I'll name three states. Now you tell me which one extends farther south. Alabama, Louisiana, or Mississippi? That is John. Louisiana. Louisiana does extend farther south. Five points for Sarasota. Holy Name's famous quotes on this one. In 1944, General Anthony McAuliffe sent a famous one-word answer to the German call for surrender at Bastion. What was that reply? Nuts. Really? Nuts. Nuts was the one-word reply. Right, five points for Holy Names. Sarasota business category. It's big business now, speaking of fire insurance, but modern fire insurance started with a tragic event in 1666. What was that event? That is Mike. Uh, the um, burning of London. Right, the Great Fire in London. Right, five points for Sarasota. Holy Names music. What is the origin of the word saxophone? In other words, how was the instrument named? That is uh, Robbie. It was named for the inventor of the music, sax. Right, named for Antoine Joseph Sax, the inventor. <coughs> Five points for Holy <coughs> Name. Sarasota literature category. The island of Monte Cristo off the island, uh, off the, uh, try this again. The island of Monte Cristo off the Italian coast was made famous in an 1844 novel by a famous French author. Name the author. John? The Count of Monte Cristo. No. Holy name, Robbie. Dumas. I said name the author, and it was Alexander Dumas. Five points for holy names. Holy names history. Four horses were shot from under this Union general in the Battle of Shiloh. Identify the general. That is Moira. Sherman. Sherman. Right, five points. Holy names. Sarasota vocabulary. Something is doubled when you have diplopia, D-I-P-L-O-P-I-A. What? That is Mike. Vision? Right, it's scientific name for double vision. Five points for Sarasota. Holy names, animals category. What kind of baby mammal is commonly referred to as a joey? J-O-E-Y. That is Sally. Kangaroo. Kangaroo, right. Five points, holy names. Sarasota, the theater. In South Pacific, what was the island that was out of bounds to enlisted men? That is Tim. Valley High. Valley High, right. Five points for Sarasota. That's time on part one. Time to check in on the score. Sarasota High School has 55. The Academy of the Holy Names has 40. And we're going to take a moment out now from the questions and answers to learn something about life at the Academy of the Holy Names from team captain Nancy Limro. Nancy? The Academy of the Holy Names, a landmark on scenic Bayshore Boulevard in Tampa, is a Catholic all-girls high school founded in 1881 by the Sisters of the Holy Names. AHN's motto, Esse Quam Videre, to be rather than to seem, expresses the school's emphasis on the personal growth of the individual student. A strong curriculum fosters the student's academic growth, while a variety of extracurricular activities develops other talents and responsibilities. AHN students are involved in service-oriented activities among the elderly and less privileged children of the community. The students occasionally entertain inner-city youngsters in AHN's pool and weekly host a bingo night at the Home Association for the Old Folks. Inner-city children were recently guests of Academy Girls at the Florida State Fair. AHN publications include Echoes, the yearbook, and Acona, the school newspaper, which holds a first-class rating from the National Scholastic Press Association. Students may participate in a variety of sports, volleyball, basketball, tennis, track, and softball. Academy swim team, Craig's Chicks, placed second in state competition last year, surpassed only by the school which placed first in national competition. The team would like to thank our moderators, Mrs. Mize and Sister Riz Christina, and WFLA for inviting us back to participate on Categorically Speaking. It's a pleasure to have you, Nancy. Nancy Lamro, captain of the team from the Academy of the Holy Names. In a moment, we'll be back with part two of Categorically Speaking. <laughs>